from the Taste and See South Florida studios at WPTV News Channel 5. It's Slay Your Day with Tony May and T.A. Tony May? T.A. So yesterday I got to interview one of the members of the Zac Brown Band. I'm jelly because I happen to love Zac Brown Band. I told you that. Well, they're coming to town twice this weekend, once on Friday, once on Saturday, both at the Coral Sky Amphitheater. And Coy Bowles is the guitarist that does all those great riffs. Oh, yeah, that he's awesome. He's just actually, really good. He's really good. Well, he's, he recorded you and guys so cute. an invite. We're playing two shows. WPTV fans and everybody out there listening, please come and see us. It's going to be a rocking show. Uh, the band's firing all cylinders, cylinders like I was talking about. And uh, we've got a lot of stuff worked up for you guys. Two shows. They're going to be uh, a little bit different each night. So if you're coming twice, then uh, you'll get your money's worth both nights. And uh, we look forward to seeing you guys. Oh, Bring that's it. cool. That is really cool. That and I like that, that it's two different shows. Two different shows. Because people who are real fans of bands, they like to go to all the shows. Yeah. And when they're different, you get more for your money. Thank it's, you, Zach Brown Band. It's like Dave Matthews. When they come to town, they do yeah, two they shows. And they're completely different. different. I yeah. love Dave Matthews. But then I told him about a little known fact here at the Coral Sky Amphitheater. Over the summer, there was some constructions behind the scenes. Yeah. To make it, it's really hot here. It's especially, so hot at Coral Sky in the summer, too. Especially back there because of the pavement where they keep oh, all the right, artists. Right, So they installed a pool, and I told them about no it. No way! So, what? Yes, yeah, so it's so hot back there, you know? Now there's like a swimming pool. Do you think y'all take a dip? Oh, man, I'm, 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 I'm the guy who goes swimming, dude. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely the guy who, like, if there's a swimming pool around, then I might jump the fence and get in, you know, kind of thing. <laughs> So, uh, uh, yeah, you'll def I'll definitely be uh, dipping my toes in the water on that one now. <laughs> Maybe you'll write a song about the pool at Coral Sky. Right. Dipping my toes in the water at Coral Sky. Right, exactly. Okay, that would be funny. <laughs> they, should, they should have a backstage uh, camera in the pool. I think there's some things like shenanigans that may go shenanigans. on. Shenanigans. <laughs> Maybe that's why they don't have a camera. It's not a camera. Shenanigans. Shenanigans. <laughs> shenanigans. So anyway, the Zach Brown Band is one of the five fun things to do this weekend. You can get the lots whole list. Lots going on. Lots, going lots, to lots. WPTV.com slash taste and uh, including this new place on, I think it's Belvedere. Oh, and, it's Belvedere right there. Right. It, we go by it. I go by it every day on the way to work. Drive Shack. We've all been waiting for this thing to open. It's like massive. Belvedere in Australian. Now go. Belvedere <laughs> oh, Australian. Sorry, right by the airport. Okay, if you've been to the airport, you've seen it, right? Yeah. That big old net that you think, gosh, what's that what for? What is it? Do you know? I've you I've, golf into it. But like from a high rise, right? Yeah, there's all different levels depending, I guess, how you want to do it. And there's a full bar. There's right. food. And I mean, they say even if you don't golf, everyone loves these places. Oh. I've never been to one. My sister's been to one. Says it is, and it's also a great place for corporate get-togethers because it's good team building. Nice. We really need this up here, I think, because so many golfers. We're the, you know, that we have more golf courses per capita than anywhere in the country. <laughs> I passed by like eight of them on the way to work. Seriously. But I don't like golf because it's hot and it takes too long. So hopefully this is. You need a lot is... of patience for golf. Yeah. You really do. That's not this guy. Um, so I'm hoping that this is something I'll enjoy. And I hope it's not like when you go bowling and there's a serious bowler on the team. You and think there'll be a serious. Golfer and then I'll mess it up. So I'm hoping that it'll be. I think you have your own little area so you don't have to go with serious. We could just all go with the goofy golfers. Goofy golfers. The putt-putt golf golfers. And then there's an event going on tonight. There is. I'm super excited to support a bunch of our friends, including my friend Peter Cruz, Josh Daniel. Uh, Bill Bone is having a celebrity bartending. They decided Josh Daniel was a celebrity. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> and uh, and um, it's at the Colony. So if you love supporting local uh, charities, it's for the Smart Ride. <laughs> and I know there's going to be a lot of fun there. So I just wanted to put a plug in because my dear friend Peter Cruz has been so great for the Women's Chamber and all these other charities. Who did you say was going to be there? The dress something? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Thank you. Say Yes to the Dress host is going to be there. And um, What is that? He doesn't know what Say Yes to the Dress is, ladies. <laughs> it's one of the greatest shows ever when brides go shopping for their wedding dress, and there's a lot of cat fighting and tackiness, and then there's always the perfect dress picker outer. <laughs> That's a word, dress picker outer. I happen to be obsessed, and I don't own cable, have not owned cable in 20 years now. So in hotels, I go right to say yes to the dress. So I hate going to the store to shop. So if I'm in so 2 Max, I. I'm like, boom, 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 out. I never knew this about you. I hate shopping, too. I disdain wow. it. I do. I, I hate it. I feel like it. it's a waste of time. Such a waste of time, <laughs> especially in great stores like TJ Maxx yeah. or Marshalls, where you have to dig through everything. Yeah. Disdain it. <laughs>
<laughs> Absolutely. Oh my God, I never knew that. Do you love shopping? I bet you do. Most people do. It's it's like a just not the two goofballs here. Yeah. So I uh, did my 500th spin class I know, yesterday. I know. I saw it online. So did everyone else. I, I you know, put but it all over here, the place. Here, here's my problem: is so you get these. You have a problem. Yeah. That's an incredible incredible accomplishment. So you get these badges, I'll bring it up full so, for you, so you can see it. Oh, and that's so, so cute, a 500 badge. So 100, you know, 250, 500, there's no more badges. I got all the badges. That's it, you're done with spin. I, Come I, to my side, we'll meet at, you know, happy hour and talk about how you used to spin. Is the consumer life cycle out of this now? Am I just done? Did I graduate? You're done. <laughs> oh, wow. You're done, go to the next hot trend. What's, oh, hot, hot, Yoga, or what is the next hot exercise? You exercise in the heat, but it's not yoga. It's like all the other- It's called walking to your car. <laughs> <laughs> in Florida, in almost November. Right, exactly. Tony May? T.A., we're here to make you smile. Start now.